This is the Johnny's Pizza House Friday Night Blitz, brought to you by Car Giant Auto Group. Welcome back, everybody. We are halfway home, but that's only halfway. We got to go to some more games. Let's do it. Carthage taking on China Spring. This is a battle of unbeaten teams in the regional round. Trey Hafford going to take the snap, keep it himself for the score. China Spring thinking upset. It's 14 0. Then Carthage gets a little tricky. Connor Cuff, Javari, and Rockmore back to Cuff on the double pass, and he takes it for six. But in the end, check this out. Thomas Barr hits the field goal. That puts the Cougars up double digits. And China Spring ends Carthage's 41 game win streak, 27 to 17. Manny, number one team in two way, looking to reach their sixth straight semifinal. First possession of the game. Tackett Curtis to Jer Jeremiah James. 47 yards later, it's 6 0 Tigers. Rose Pine trying to respond. Ethan Fry, the LSU baseball commit to Javion Smart. Only problem is Javion Smart plays for Manny. A pick six makes it 22 to nothing. And then Fry puts this one on the ground. Who else but Tackett Curtis to fall on it? Manny scores four touchdowns in just four minutes. The Tigers roll to the semis 50 to 12. Staying in 2A, North Cato trying to make the semifinals for the first time in school history, hosting of Oils, the Mustangs. Also trying to make it for the first time ever, Travion Prater on the fullback dive. That makes it 7 0, but the Titans answer 8 0, rather. Javontavius Hodge on fourth and goal. Going to be close. The refs say he got in. It's 8 8. Mustangs up 16 8 in the second. Hodge calls his own number, and no one's going to catch him. We got a high scoring one. We're tied at 16. Under a minute left in the half. 24 16. Omari and Miller. He was quiet for most of the first half. Not anymore. Takes this one all the way in for six, but it's a Voyles who ends North Caddo's season. 46 28. The Mustangs are headed to the semis for the first time ever. North Caddo falls in their first ever quarterfinal matchup. Over to Texas. Beckville taking on Timpson. Both undefeated district champions in the third round of the playoffs. First drive for the Bearcats. Ryan Harris bounces off the pile and gets in for the score. It's 7 0 Bearcats, but here comes Timpson. They get the touchdown there, and then a quarterback sneak extends the lead. Timpson rolls over Beckville 42 to 21. The Bears are headed to the quarterfinals. And we go to Beast Texas, two of the best teams in East Texas, Gilmer and Van. Gilmer down 7 0 when Brandon Tennyson finds Parker Gillo, turns it upfield, steps to a tackler. And he races in for the score. Look at him go. We are tied up at seven. Vandals with the ball. It's fourth and one. Jackson Rainey pulls the ball, runs right, leaps over a defender, and he is gone. Look at the athleticism from the Van Vandals. They retake the lead 14 to seven. But here come the Buckeyes. Tennyson looking deep, fires to the end zone. Gillo, hello, leaps up and snags it. Touchdown, Gilmer and the Buckeyes. They've got a date with Pleasant Grove next week, 56 to 35. Some more scores now. Texas High. This game over in Natchitoches. The Tigers. They just keep rolling. They remain undefeated. They defeat Port Neches Groves 44 to 21 and Gladewater. Their magical run comes to an end against Mount Vernon 40 to 14. Logan Sport, the number one seed in 1A. They are still alive. They head to the semifinals 44 to 14. They defeat the Seals. 